we're going to talk about how to make something password protected so that your audience can view something, let's say like a music video that your band may have created or something like that, but you don't want everybody else to see it, but you still want it to get it out to like the band parents. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to want to have whatever you want to have password protected in your Google Docs. Um, I'm just going to work with this little uh, document right here and um, we need to go change our share settings. So I'm going to go to the share and I'm going to click on change and I'm going to make it be that anyone with the link and it's going to update that. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to copy this link really fast and I'm going to say done. Once I have that done, I'm going to go over and I'm going to create a Google form. So I go to my Google Forms and I'm going to give it a title of password protected. And then I'm going to have one question and it's going to be, what is the password? All right, it's going to turn it into a short answer. Then I'm going to go down here. I'm going to one, make it required. And two, I'm going to tell it that I want response validation. When I turn that on, it gives me some op um, options down here to choose. I want it to be a password, so I'm going to say I want it to be a text and it needs to contain. And then you want to put in here what your password is. And you can add capitals and all sorts of things. So I'm just going to put secret password. And then in your custom error text, I'm, if this is what you're going to put in to say if something's wrong. Um, sorry try again um, and then once that is done so that's the message if they type in the wrong password then they'll get this message then I'm gonna go up here to my settings and I'm going to take off restricted and I'm going to go to presentation and it says show link to submit another response you can actually turn that on or off it doesn't matter but your confirmation message, this is where you're going to put in your link. And so I could say something like, um, thanks for supporting the arts. Here's the link to our show. And then I just hit control paste and in it goes and I hit save. So now this is totally password protected. Um, I can go to the preview over here and this is what it would look like. So you would give this link, you would give this form to like your parents or whatever, and you would also send them the password. So then you would have, they would type in, if they type in something wrong, like, um, dogs are fun. Okay. And they go to hit the submit button. It'll say, sorry, please try again. So now we've typed in secret password and you'll notice now that line is gone and now it will go I hit submit and it takes me thanks for supporting the arts here's links to our show click on this and it redirects me to that document that I had up to begin with which would be your film if you wanted it to be like a video or something like that so that is how you use password protection to lock something down